<clears throat> this is the book of Luke, chapter 21, verse 11. And it reads, A great earthquake shall there be in uh, Salaki. And great earthquakes shall there be in diverse places, famines and pestilence and fearful sights. And great signs shall there be from heaven. Uh, Shalom, first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem, Wagakadash. Uh, double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, preaching his word truthfully and sincerely, and Shalom to the Akim, scattered through the four corners of the globe, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely, and Shalom to the Akim, that be like unto the speck of word, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely. Say Shalom to the Akim out there. And this is a sit down lesson on this uh, Saturday night, 9 05 p.m. Central Standard Time on October 1st, 2022. You know, it's Saturday. And, uh, this is a news article recently from Jerusalem Post. And, um, this is by Reuters and published October the 1st, 2022. And the highlight of this news article, and it reads for In the News on October 1st, 2022. Uh, and it reads, uh, magnitude. 5.6 uh, earthquake hits Kaishu uh, region if in Japan, the EMSC. A magnitude of a 5.6 earthquake struck Japan's Kaishu region on Saturday. The European Mediterranean Semiological uh, Century says the quake was about 40 kilometers, I mean kilometers, Salaki, uh, 25 below the Earth's surface. So yeah, as I stated, I brought out that scripture, 20, uh, Luke 21 and 11, and there shall be earthquakes in diverse places. And these earthquakes in diverse places, especially the uh, increase in the magnitudes on a balanced scale, a balanced up and down scale between these uh, earthquakes in diverse places has definitely been increasing, you know, especially in the year 2022, all the way to 2020 and all the way into 2022. You've been seeing a high increase of magnitudes of earthquakes in diverse places. You know, because the Heavenly Father is definitely visiting this earth, which he made, you know. Let me see if I can bring that in egg, that, uh, egg, Second Ezra's, I believe. Second Ezra's. Salakia so spelled Ezra's wrong. I think it's Ezra's nine and one, if I'm not mistaken. Second, not first, uh, second answer. Second verse. Well, we'll check and see. Uh, this is second uh, Ezra chapter 9 verse 2 thou shalt understand that it is the very same time where wherein the highest will begin to visit the world which he made second Ezra 9 and 3 therefore there shall be seen earthquakes in diverse places Yep, because you're seeing the uh, earthquakes in diverse places. And as I brought it out, second address 9 and 2, you know, the highest is beginning to visit the place which he made. And that's what we're seeing. You know, you see what happened down there in Florida. Uh, hurricane, uh, Hurricane F F F F Finna, if I pronounce that right. What happened over there in Dominican Republic? 
<clears throat> Puerto Rico, Cuba, you know, the Heavenly Father is definitely visiting this place, which he made, you know, and it's going to increase more and more and more, you know, and so as we already uh, a couple of weeks, I said about two weeks in hurricane season. So, yeah, hey, um, earthquakes in diverse places increasing, these tsunamis, these uh, storms, these earthquakes in diverse places. These are heavy floodings, uh, record breaker rains, these are heavy heat waves we had over the summer. These are heavy droughts, uh, the famines, pestilence, et cetera, you name it, you know. Hey, that's showing signs, and I brought that little Luke 21 11, you know. She'll see, see great signs from him, and on upon the earth as well, too. So, hey. Yeah, Bashim Al Shai is definitely visiting this place, which he made, you know. The highest should visit the place, you know. And that's what the Heavenly Father, <clears throat> Yah, with thy power, is doing. Visiting this place, which he made, because this earth is his footstool, you know. And he's been passing it, pass it on down to his only begotten son, which is uh, Yah Al Shai. Uh, Hamashiach Al Shai in the ancient Hebrew, you know, in the ancient Paleo Hebrew. That's the Heavenly Father's only begotten son, which is Yah Al Shai, you know. They definitely visiting this place with which they made, you know, because it's not it's not uh mother, mother it's not mother nature or climate change or nothing like that. It's the heavenly father that's you know doing doing these things on the planet Earth, you know. As I mentioned before, with these heavy earthquakes, uh, diverse places, the high increase of numbers of magnitudes of the earthquakes in diverse places, uh, the floodings, uh, the storms. I mean, you name it, wildfires, uh, volcano erupts, uh, dust storms, uh, large hills, I mean, you name it, you know, yeah, how about Shemel Shai is done doing these things on the planet Earth, and doesn't have nothing to do with Mother Nature or climate change or nothing like that, it's the Heavenly Father that's doing these things, and that's why I brought out 2nd Ezra's 9 and 2, which the highest uh, visit the world, which which he made, you know, from the beginning and all the way to now, you know. Hey, yeah, Bashim al Shah is definitely going to continue to visit this place, which he made with these uh, earthquakes and storms, heavy floodings, heavy rains, record breaker rains, you know. And it's going to increase more and more and more, you know. So, with that, you know, I just want to bring out this uh, sit down lesson. Of this news update of this uh, earthquake of a 5.6 magnitude hit Japan in that area, in that region over there, hit right with a 5.6 earthquake, you know. So, with that, once again, I hope this lesson was edifying through the spirit of progress and mercy of the Hawaii Awashai. And first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem, Wakakadash, double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, preach the word truthfully and sincerely, and Shalom to the Akim scattered the four corners of the globe, preach the word truthfully and sincerely, and Shalom to the Akim scattered the four corners of the globe, that be like unto the speckled bird, preach the word truthfully and sincerely. And until next time, I will say Shalom and a ball, ball.